Hold on. Look how beautiful she looks. It's my wedding day. It is? Yeah. Yeah, it, it is. is. And like I'm wearing a lot of jewelry but this one just wouldn't wouldn't go. And also this place is called the National Cathedral. And it's beautiful actually. We can go outside for a little bit. Maybe while we wait for the photographer to come and take a few shots of us. The photographer other than me. Other than he took a few shots and I'll, I'll definitely put some of his pictures um, here for you to see. The, this is my sari. This is a Kanjivaram silk sari in hot pink. Mm -hmm. uh, and I bought it from Sabyasachi India. So this is from Sabyasachi's Delhi store. And um, they sent the sari to my father in Calcutta. I actually selected this through the Calcutta store and they showed me a couple of sari pictures and I picked this one, which was in the Delhi store. And they sent it to my dad and my dad uh, sent it to me through my friend, which I already talked about in my previous vlog. These earrings though, these are from Anupam. These were my anniversary present from him. They are from Tanish India, so they are like gold and diamond. And I really like these. I wear fake eyelashes for the very first time. And I don't really like it. But come with me, I'll show you the place outside. I mean, it has a competition around you. No, there were other weddings going on here too, and I didn't see those brides. I'm sure they looked good too. I had a peak, yeah, possibly peak. not that great. Oh, peaks. Well, you are my husband, so. Uh huh. So yeah, this is for the Indian one. We've had a civil wedding already. Yeah. All right then. We'll show you the other things later. Get that. So we've come to this Indian restaurant called La Mirch. It's quite nice actually, a really big. Anupam got uh, an old fashioned as usual. I got mango lassi. I mean, I can steal some of that. Yeah, of course. Go for it. Go for it. We are at the Vigilant Park Cafe and after the whole photo shoot yesterday. Now, we are, today we were very tired. We had a couple of invitations for 4th of July. Uh, celebrations but we skipped everything because we were so tired from yesterday and it's also like really hot today like 31 degrees so we just stayed at home all day we can stand this in our uh, in India but somehow it always feels not our own yeah. it's a bit much a bit harsh and um, yeah so we just had our lunch at home rested very well today and at like six o'clock we left home to get some just a walk and a little bit of a chill time in a cafe that's this one but it was so hot it was really hot anyway so i got matcha iced matcha and anupam got cold brew so yeah Is here. Came to little, not little, and I'm gonna get banana. This one looks a bit ripe. Maybe it, this stock came yesterday. Uh, a little less ripe, I guess. It's okay if it gets too ripe. I'll make banana bread out of it. Toilet paper and banana, that's all we needed today. Happy 4th 
4th of July. Wow, just from my bedroom. I like this road view. More fireworks. I can only imagine how amazing it must be at the mall, at the National Mall near the monument. But we didn't go there this time. We went there in 2020. We booked a hotel uh, at the Hamilton uh, in DC, which is very close to the National Mall and we basically clicked a lot of pictures from the hotel room and that was uh, the pandemic year and kind of in the peak of pandemic so they still did the celebrations it's just we didn't go out in public we just booked a very high um, monument side facing uh, room so it was in a high-rise hotel so we could get a really amazing view of the whole fireworks uh, session and it was amazing and, and once you've seen that it's almost like you've seen everything it was so, so stunning um, of course we didn't see it from the grounds but what we saw was much better because it was from the comfort of our hotel room and it was safe uh, considering it was the pandemic time so yeah and now I'm getting this view so it's okay that we didn't go see that one was so nice so it's okay that we didn't go to a crowded place this time to see the fireworks and actually you never know right like being in crowds is still kind of risky so it's better this is pretty good i have no regrets for not going out anywhere for fourth of july this time actually Anupam and i went for a coffee as you as you just saw so yeah this is gorgeous the pool so quiet and peaceful Beautiful Sunday. It's cold. I'm sweaty. We're going to an conventional diner. We really like going there because of their cornbread muffins. And they serve it with a kind of spicy butter, which is really yum. I love it. So, yeah, I'm going there for the second time today. I know I've been there a couple of times. So, yeah. Oh, and also, this video is coming. A little late than usual because I have not yet received the pictures of our wedding and I wanted to put a compilation of some of the pictures here so yeah you saw a video of me at the venue but then nothing after that because I got busy and but you you can see the pictures when, once they come in I'll put all of them in this video okay. we got this tip top shop Looks like a lot of greens and falafel and hummus. Are you excited to try this? <laughs> he doesn't like healthy food. This is very healthy. So I think I almost ate all of that salad with the falafel. Anubam liked it. He's not a big fan of salads. But it had hummus and the way it was made was very different. It had almonds and peanuts and pomegranates and um, uh, I think raisins, some kind of raisin. And oh, he's taking pictures. And that made it really yummy. And it also had hummus. So anything with hummus is really, really tasty. So that's why we really enjoyed it. So even though he didn't, he ate it, but he didn't eat a lot. 
so it was just me i ate a lot today after a very very long time like those cornbread muffins i had almost one and a half and i hope i had two and a half because at the half i couldn't finish it was very buttery and heavy and i was almost had all the chicken pot pie poppers so and, and all the greens that came with it i'm a big fan of greens actually i eat a lot of vegetables so yeah that was mostly my dinner and anupa made very less but i actually didn't eat that much this morning like even for lunch i just ate half a sandwich so i was kind of hungry but yeah that's all this really pretty so i'm going to bake them wired now to buy cupcakes for my friend the the same friend who i visited in baltimore two weeks ago she's coming to dc tomorrow and i want to give her some cupcakes so we're going to bake them wired to get cupcakes for her here at the big joint and we got karen's birthday cupcakes we got a cupcake called karen's birthday it has cookies I'm taking street pictures because he's a street photographer. That's what he does. Are we? Do we have to cross? No, we don't have to cross, do we? I wanted to ride those scooters home. They're very good, environmental friendly. Environment friendly. environment friendly yeah but how do they charge are they charged electric yeah electronically yeah i really like those things those are far better than cars and look more fun right 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 coffee these apartments look old or am i too spoiled by your new apartment am i i'm carrying some cupcakes for deepanita she's my friend it's a dark chocolate cupcake it's huge i don't know if she'd like it but it's called chocolate cupcake for doom or something cupcake by do or something like that it's very chocolatey the the sponge is chocolate the cream ganache is dark chocolate very yummy maybe i'll end the video from here today and i'm going to add the wedding pictures later at the end of it So bye bye from Washington DC. I mean I really don't have much to show today. I showed a lot of walking tour in the last few days and I don't want to repeat the same thing. So yeah, I'll just let it be here. Bye.